The Indian Express has reported that over 20 women are alleged to have been taken to former Chief Secretary of Andaman and Nicobar Islands, Jitendra Narayan's house at Port Blair during his tenure, and some of them are said to have got jobs in lieu of being sexually exploited. Investigators told the newspaper that police has found evidence and recorded key witness statements pointing to an alleged job for sex racket. Narayan and former Labour Commissioner R.L. Rishi have been accused of sexual exploitation by a 21-year-old woman, leading to the formation of a special investigation team which is probing the case. Narayan is expected to appear before the SIT on October 28, the last date set for his appearance by the Calcutta High Court. Senior police officers in Port Blair confirmed to the Indian Express that call data records of mobile phones of the two bureaucrats and of the 21-year-old match, the alleged sequence of events on two dates as provided by the woman. Sources have also confirmed to the newspaper that the hard disk of the CCTV camera system installed at Narayan's house was first erased and subsequently removed at the time of his transfer from Port Blair to Delhi in July. Denying the charges, Narayan in letters to the Home Ministry and the Island Administration has said there is a conspiracy against him and claim that he has specific materials which demonstrate the fake nature of the case. He has challenged his presence in Port Blair on one of the two dates given in the FIR and cited air tickets and appointment schedules to show his presence in New Delhi. Narayan was suspended on orders of the Home Ministry on October 17th and has got in Terem bail until November 14th. Rishi has also been suspended and non-bailable warrants have been issued in his name after his bail plea was rejected in Port Blair.